information owner or data owner, one is not more correct or wrong than the other. They are just different words used to describe the same thing. That's how you have to study. That's how you have to be a CISP and a better security professional than you were yesterday. Because when you're in the security industry, I guarantee you nobody's ever going to identify anyone as the data owner or information owner. It's, it's probably going to be more something like, yeah, uh, Rakesh and sales, he can give you access to the information. Or, or, or Prashant, the vice president, yeah, he'll give you access to those records. That's just how it is. You're studying the CIS not to just pass the exam, but to be prepared to deal with whatever unknown you encounter in the real world. And believe me, you will encounter nothing but unknowns, especially if you're new to the industry, or especially if you're, if you're new in, into a new organization. It, it, it's like the book I'm reading called Pandora Star. Your, your, your introduction to the security industry will be as if a wormhole was discovered, which has the ability to take you 750 light years across the galaxy to a place where things defy even the very physics of what we consider reality. You'll encounter situations, processes, and ways of security life unlike any you may have studied about in your books. But you'll be able to handle it because you are studying so hard right now and just believe me, you'll be able to handle it. All this reading, doing practice questions, looking at mind maps, or joining groups to discuss things, this is all preparation for not just the exam, but the security life in general. You're reading your books diligently, so you build the discipline to read CVEs or technical manuals in the real world. You're taking practice questions now in order to quickly and knowledgeably answer questions from clients or customers in the security world. You're joining CISP groups and having discussions now so you can attend conference calls with 20 people around the world from multiple cultures and countries all trying to figure out one problem facing the organization. That's what's really going on here with the CISP. The Study Notes in Theory Facebook group has over 41,000 members from across the world twice over. There are stories of incredible hardships, failures, successes, and losses. There's a guy who went on to pass his exam after suffering a brain hemorrhage. There's someone who failed the exam five times and passed it on his sixth attempt. Imagine the time and investment. I mean, join this group if you haven't done so already. You, you won't be disappointed. Join the group and at some point, you will become a cis. Uh, I've seen it done hundreds of times. And also, it's, it's not about the exam. It's not about something that's three hours and 150 questions. It's not about whether you pass or fail. It's about building the discipline necessary to handle what's really coming at you later. It's not, it's, it's, it's about not needing constant motivation. The CSP is not for someone who needs constant motiva motivation. Not just the CSP. Security, information security, this industry is not for those who need constant motivation. You got to want to do this thing. No one's begging you to join. No one's begging you to come into this. No one's, no one's looking for you to join and take their money because you get paid a lot of money for this. So we're not looking for you to come in and take our share. <laughs> the less you know, the better it is for us. Right, we get we get the lion's share of the money that way. It's ours. You want it, you gotta come get it. All right, it's 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 about doing a security job upon which the very welfare of your family may one day depend on. Look at your situation now. Look, I know I'm blabbling on, but I think this will help somebody out there. Look at your situation now. Do you think your life would have been better or not better with a CISP after your name? Don't tell me, just answer that to yourself. How much better could your life have been right now, during a pandemic, as a father, wife, husband, mother, son, daughter, employer, employee, with a CISP? That's what we're doing here, guys. That's all that Studios in Theory and myself are trying to do here. Trying to make your life just a bit more tolerable because of all the things you already have to go through. Okay, this, this, this stuff is important to know. Studying for the CISP exam is hard, but trust me, the hard work only really begins 
after you pass the CSP exam. And that's the realest thing you'll hear today. Okay, so back to the choices we're seeing. I'm going to put...